second video in my fall series and this is more of a Halloween inspired video as Halloween is just around the corner. So I thought I would do a nail art video. So in this video I am going to show you three different nail art designs based around Halloween and they're all super super simple so you should definitely try them out if you're kind of looking for ideas for Halloween nails then this is the video for you. <laughs> so let's just hop right into the video. So this first design is a kind of spooky eyes in the dark sort of design. It's super simple but super effective. So all you will need is a black and white polish. So first you're going to paint all your nails black and then taking a dotting tool and some white polish you're just going to dot on two circles to be the eyeballs and this is what it should look like. Next take a smaller dotting tool and some black nail polish and dot on two pupils and this is it. I put it on my ring finger and my thumb but you can put them on all fingers or just one whatever you like. So I think this next design is pretty cool. It is a spider's web with three little spiders coming down off the web. So first off you will need to paint your nails a light purple polish and then paint them two coats of a purple glittery polish. On the first finger we are going to use a small paintbrush to paint a line down the centre and then fan out more lines and this is to make the spider's web. Next we are going to do some curved lines just to join up those lines. And she says, I wish that I could be like the cool kids Cause all the cool kids, they seem to And this is what it should look like. On our middle finger we are going to paint a line down the centre and then a line near the top of the nail and then half a line near the base of the nail. We are going to then take a dotting tool and draw on a small oval to be the spider's body and taking the paintbrush again we are going to draw on some legs and these don't need to be perfect because the spider is quite small. On the ring finger we are going to paint a line down the centre again and then a half line near the top of the nail. Then taking the dotting tool we are going to draw another spider's body and give him some legs as well. So on the pinky finger we are going to draw a little half line in the centre and taking the dotting tool we are going to draw quite a big oval to be the spider's body and this is going to fill most of the nail. Then taking a small paintbrush we are going to draw on some legs and these legs are going to be bigger than the previous spider legs we have drawn as this spider is bigger. Um, I did some kind of bent legs as well as straight legs. So this is what it should look like once that is all done. Next you're going to take a white polish and dot this on to be the eyeballs of all the spiders. I used a bigger dotting tool on the pinky finger spider as he is bigger. And next taking a black polish and a smaller dotting tool you're going to dot on the pupils of the eyes. So this is the final look. I think it's pretty cool and I loved wearing this look. So this final design is a blood splatter design and I think this is awesome and all you will need is a white polish, a red polish and some straws. So I started by painting my nails white and then dipping a straw in red nail polish I blew this onto my nails and it is just so simple, kind of messy but really simple. So once all my nails were sufficiently covered in blood splatter, I took a q-tip soaked in nail polish remover and just tidied up the edges of my nails. And that is it. So simple but really cool for Halloween. So that is it for the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it and if you try out any of the nail art designs then let me know in the comments or tweet me a picture at HoneyLustHells or you can Instagram me at HoneyLustHells as well because I would love to see your guys' recreations of these designs. So that is it and I will see you in my next video. Bye! And she says, I wish that I could be like the cool kids Cause all the cool kids, they seem to think